Hello friends, welcome to my channel Instrument Calibration. If you are new on this channel, and if you have missed my previous videos, then you can find links in the description box. Today's video is on some common terms, which are used in the field of instrumentation and calibration. These common terms are zero adjustment and span adjustment. First of all, let's learn. What is span? In technical world, span is algebraic difference between upper and lower range values. In other words, URV minus LRV is known as span. Let's take one example to understand this thing. Let us assume that pressure transmitter calibration range is 0 to 400 kPa. What is span value of this pressure transmitter? In this example, span value will be 400 minus 0. So, span value will be 400 kPa. Let's take another example to understand concept of span. In this example, 20 to 50 inch H2O is the calibration range of level transmitter. In this example, span value will be 50 minus 20. So, span value will be 30 inch H2O. Let's understand, what is span adjustment? Span adjustment is used to set the upper limit point, or 100% mark of the instrument range. In order to set upper limit point, 100% of input signal is given to instrument, and output of instrument is adjusted to 100%. Let's understand, what is zero adjustment? Zero adjustment is also known as offset adjustment. It is used to set the lower limit point, or reference point of the instrument. In order to set lower limit point, 0% of input signal is given to instrument, and output of instrument is adjusted to 0%. For example, when instrument output is 2% for 0% of input signal. In this case, this instrument requires zero adjustment. Lastly, let's understand the concept of linearity adjustment. Linearity adjustment is used to set equal travel above and below the 50% mark on the instrument range. This adjustment generally applies to mechanical instruments, and instruments with gearing, or link and lever mechanisms, or board and tubes, diaphragms, or bellows. In conclusion, in this video, we have learned about span adjustment, zero adjustment, and linearity adjustment. If you have any doubts about these concepts, then please feel free to ask me your questions in comment box. Thank you friends for watching this video. If you really like this video, then please share this video with your friends. And subscribe this channel, so that you will not miss any informative videos like this.